Hello guys, in this video I will show you how you can create a hexagon layer using deck.gl and mapbox. So if you see uh, here we are getting these 2D hexagons and uh, if you want to visualize it in 3D you can use this uh, deck.gl hexagon layer. So if you see uh, now it's looking amazing and uh, we can uh, correlate our height our feature uh, properties like uh, if ha if it has some kind of elevation or number of population uh, feature properties inside our feature and so we can correlate uh, this uh, hexagonal height with that uh, property so using hexagon layer you can uh, get some more meaningful uh, 3d visualization over map okay so let's start with coding uh, I will use open my Visual Studio code and I already created this HTML document. So you, you can see I am importing my Mapbox GL uh, dependencies and deck.gl dependencies and access for loading my file. So uh, I already prepared this JSON file. You can see uh, it has point feature. So I will use this JSON for this tutorial. Okay, so uh, let me go to my demo.html file and uh, let me import this file first so with access.get method we can import our points.json file and after this we will go to the tech.gl uh, website and uh, you can find this uh, documentation is available on tech.gl website and for hexagon layer i will use this uh, for my uh, for creating this hexagon layer so let me copy it again from here and uh, paste it here for data i will use this response dot data dot features so basically uh, uh, hexagon layer doesn't accept geojson means feature collection proper json uh, we have to pass some array of array kind of data and uh, i will remove this pickable because i don't want some our or click effect and radius i will make it uh, 50 only i think 80 is enough for this okay and uh, for position we have to configure like uh, uh, if you see uh, for t dot coordinates so we want if you see my json file we have coordinates inside our geometry so we have to uh, do some thing here like uh, for from feature i want my geometry so and from geometry i want my coordinates okay with this i think our setup is ready now uh, we have to just define type for this map box layer so i will put it here and uh, i will create a map box layer and uh, we have to import this hexagon layer from uh, this deck okay so with this we are ready i think now let me see, check some other properties which we can set like uh, if we see uh, i want to do some elevation so for elevation you need to set some other properties like get elevation so let me find it here so here uh, you can see this get elevation property i will copy it from here and uh, i will paste it here and now uh, for get elevation i will use math dot random because uh, i not i haven't included any such kind of property so i will use math dot random and uh, value between i want from 150 i think uh, let me multiply multiply it with 150 okay and now 
let me add this layer inside my box so my box dot add layer okay so with this we are done with hexagon layer now save it and let me start my server okay guys so now our hexagon layer is here and it's looking amazing on map so uh, you can use this for your 3d geo spatial data visualization and uh, thank you guys for watching this video if you find this video is informative for you please do like and subscribe thank you